Chapter 1. The Call to Arms In the distant reaches of the galaxy aboard the USS Horizon, Captain Kara Anders monitored the silent void through the viewport. Her crew moved with practiced efficiency, their routine interrupted only by the occasional blip on the radar. Suddenly the calm was shattered by an urgent distress signal. Kara's eyes narrowed as she analyzed the transmission. It originated from a nearby planet, one she knew well. Earth. Patch it through, she ordered, her voice steady but commanding. The holographic display flickered to life, revealing a frantic scene. Earth, the cradle of humanity, was under attack by an unknown alien force. Cities burned, and screams echoed across the transmission. Kara's jaw clenched, and her eyes flashed with determination. Earth may have been her home world, but she hadn't set foot on its soil in years. Still, the call to arms was clear. Prepare for immediate warp, she commanded, turning to her crew. We're heading to Earth. Without hesitation, the crew sprang into action. The hum of the ship's engines filled the air as they surged toward their destination. In the distance, the glow of Earth grew brighter, a beacon of hope amidst the chaos. As they neared the planet, Kara's mind raced with questions. Who were these attackers? What did they want? But there was no time for answers, only action. Weapons at the ready, Kara ordered, her voice cutting through the tension. We're going in hot. With a final surge of power, the USS Horizon entered Earth's atmosphere, ready to confront whatever awaited them below. And though the odds may have seemed insurmountable, Kara knew one thing for certain. Humanity would not go down without a fight. Chapter 2. The Human Spirit As the USS Horizon descended through Earth's atmosphere, Captain Kara Anders surveyed the devastation below. Smoke billowed from the ruins of once thriving cities, and the scent of burning metal lingered in the air, but amidst the chaos there were signs of resistance. Scan for survivors, Kara commanded, her voice firm. We need to find anyone still fighting back. The ship's scanners hummed to life, sweeping the landscape for signs of life. It wasn't long before they detected a group of human soldiers huddled in the remnants of a skyscraper. Coordinates locked, reported Lieutenant Ramirez, her fingers flying across the control panel. Preparing to transport. With a shimmer of light, the soldiers materialized on the bridge, their faces drawn and weary but determined. We're the last of our unit, one of them said, his voice tinged with exhaustion, but we're not giving up without a fight. Kara nodded, her respect for their resilience evident. We're here to help, she assured them but we need to know what we're up against. The soldiers exchanged a glance before one of them stepped forward, a grim expression on his face. They're like nothing we've ever seen before, he said. Their ships are massive, and their weapons are beyond anything we have. Kara's brow furrowed as she processed the information. It seemed Earth was facing an enemy unlike any they had encountered before, but she refused to be deterred. Prepare to launch a counterattack, she ordered, her voice unwavering. We may be outnumbered, but we have something they don't. The human spirit. With that, the crew of the USS Horizon sprang into action, coordinating their efforts with the human soldiers. Together, they would face the unknown threat head-on, determined to defend their home planet at all costs. Chapter 3. The Unlikely Alliance. As the USS Horizon and the remaining human forces prepared for the impending battle, Captain Kara Anders knew they needed every advantage they could muster. Scanning the horizon from the bridge, she searched for any sign of the enemy's approach. Suddenly a blip appeared on the radar, growing larger with each passing moment. The enemy fleet had arrived. Shields up, Kara ordered, her voice steady. Prepare to engage. The crew moved with precision, their training kicking in as they readied their weapons for the coming onslaught. But just as they prepared to fire, something unexpected happened. A second blip appeared on the radar, this one approaching from behind the enemy fleet. Kara's eyes widened in surprise as she recognized the signature. It was another human ship. Identify yourself, Kara called out over the comms, her heart pounding with anticipation. This is Captain Jackson of the USS Valor, came the reply. We received your distress signal and came as fast as we could. Kara couldn't help but smile. It seemed they weren't alone in this fight after all. 
Welcome to the party, Captain, she said, her voice filled with relief. We could use all the help we can get. With the combined forces of the USS Horizon and the USS Valor, the odds suddenly seemed a little less daunting. Together, they devised a plan to take down the enemy fleet, coordinating their attacks with precision and skill. As the battle raged on, Kara watched from the bridge, her heart swelling with pride at the sight of humanity standing united against a common threat. Though the enemy was fierce and their numbers great, they were no match for the determination and resilience of the human spirit. In the end, it was this spirit that carried them to victory, driving the enemy forces back and securing Earth's freedom once more. And as the dust settled and the sun began to rise on a new day, Kara knew that no matter what challenges lay ahead, humanity would always rise to meet them, stronger and more united than ever before. Chapter 4 Rebuilding from the Ashes With the enemy vanquished and Earth's skies once again clear, the true magnitude of the devastation became apparent. Cities lay in ruins, and countless lives had been lost in the battle. But amidst the rubble, there was also hope. As the crew of the USS Horizon surveyed the damage from orbit, they knew their work was far from over. They had fought to defend Earth, and now they would help rebuild it. Begin scanning for survivors and infrastructure damage, Kara instructed her crew. We need to assess the situation and offer assistance wherever we can. The crew worked tirelessly, using the ship's advanced technology to locate survivors and provide aid to those in need. Meanwhile, on the surface, Teams of volunteers worked together to clear debris and establish makeshift shelters for the displaced. In the days that followed, aid poured in from across the galaxy as other civilizations offered their support to help Earth recover. Together, they began the long process of rebuilding, turning the shattered remnants of cities into symbols of resilience and hope. But amidst the chaos and destruction, there were also moments of unity and compassion. Strangers became friends and neighbors banded together to support one another in their time of need. It was a reminder that even in the darkest of times, humanity's greatest strength was its ability to come together as one. As the weeks turned into months, Earth began to heal, its scars slowly fading as new life blossomed from the ashes. And though the memory of the battle would never be forgotten, it served as a reminder of what humanity was capable of when faced with adversity. On the bridge of the USS Horizon, Kara Anders looked down at the planet below, a sense of pride swelling in her chest. They had answered the call to arms, and though the road ahead would be long and challenging, she knew that with determination and unity, humanity would always prevail. Chapter 5. A New Beginning With Earth's recovery well underway, Captain Kara Anders and the crew of the USS Horizon turned their attention to the future. The scars of the recent conflict served as a reminder of the importance of unity and cooperation, not just among humans but among all the inhabitants of the galaxy. As Earth rebuilt, new alliances were forged and old rivalries set aside in favor of mutual understanding and collaboration. The once divided nations of Earth came together, pooling their resources and expertise to ensure that the mistakes of the past were not repeated. On the galactic stage, Humanity's resilience and determination had earned them newfound respect. They were no longer seen as a mere footnote in the annals of history, but as a force to be reckoned with, a testament to the indomitable spirit of the human race. As the years passed, Earth flourished, its cities rising from the ashes, stronger and more vibrant than ever before. The scars of the past faded, replaced by a renewed sense of purpose and optimism for the future. But amidst the celebrations and triumphs, Kara knew that the galaxy was vast and filled with challenges yet to be faced. New threats lurked in the shadows, waiting for their moment to strike. It was up to her and the crew of the USS Horizon to stand vigilant, ready to defend humanity and its allies against whatever may come their way. As the sun set on another day, Kara looked out at the stars, a sense of peace settling over her. The journey had been long and arduous, but it had also been filled with moments of triumph and camaraderie. And as she watched the stars twinkle in the darkness, she knew that whatever the future held, humanity would face it together with courage, resilience, and the unwavering belief that no challenge was too great to overcome. 
Chapter 6. Legacy of the Angry Humans As time passed and the memory of the conflict faded, the legend of the angry humans lived on. It became a tale told in hushed whispers among the stars, a cautionary reminder of the folly of underestimating the resilience of humanity. The term angry humans ceased to be an insult and instead became a badge of honor, symbolizing humanity's unwavering determination in the face of adversity. It was a reminder that beneath their calm exterior, humans possessed a fierce spirit that could not be extinguished. Across the galaxy, monuments were erected to honor the brave men and women who had fought to defend Earth. Their sacrifices were not forgotten, their names immortalized in the annals of history as heroes who had stood against overwhelming odds and emerged victorious. But perhaps the greatest legacy of the angry humans was the spirit of unity and cooperation that had emerged in the wake of the conflict. Old rivalries were set aside and alliances strengthened as the galaxy came together to ensure that such a tragedy would never be repeated. And at the heart of it all stood Captain Kara Anders and the crew of the USS Horizon, their actions serving as a shining example of courage, leadership and resilience. Though they had faced many challenges along the way, they had never wavered in their commitment to defending humanity and its allies. As the stars twinkled overhead, casting their light across the cosmos, Kara knew that the legacy of the angry humans would endure for generations to come. And though their journey may have come to an end, their spirit would live on. A beacon of hope in a galaxy filled with uncertainty. Chapter 7. The Continuing Saga With peace restored to Earth and stability returning to the galaxy, Captain Kara Anders and her crew embarked on a new chapter in their journey. The USS Horizon continued its mission of exploration, venturing into uncharted territories and forging new alliances with civilizations across the stars. But even as they charted new worlds and made new friends, Kara knew that the galaxy was vast and filled with mysteries yet to be uncovered. Rumors of ancient artifacts and hidden civilizations whispered through the void, tempting the crew to embark on daring quests in search of answers. As they traveled from star system to star system, Kara and her crew encountered wonders beyond imagination. Planets teeming with life, nebulae ablaze with color, and phenomena that defied explanation. Each discovery fueled their sense of wonder and renewed their determination to push the boundaries of exploration ever further. But amidst the excitement of their adventures, Kara never forgot the lessons learned during the conflict with the unknown enemy. She remained vigilant, ever aware of the dangers lurking in the darkness, and ready to defend humanity and its allies at a moment's notice. As the USS Horizon continued its journey through the cosmos, Kara knew that the road ahead would be filled with challenges and trials, but she also knew that with courage, determination and the unwavering support of her crew, there was no obstacle they could not overcome. And so, with the stars as their guide and the spirit of the angry humans burning bright within them, they forged ahead into the unknown, ready to face whatever adventures lay in store. For theirs was a saga that would continue to unfold across the vast expanse of the galaxy, leaving a legacy that would endure for eternity. Chapter 8. Reflections As the USS Horizon traversed the endless expanse of space, Captain Kara Anders found herself reflecting on the journey that had brought them to this point. The events of the past seemed like distant memories, yet their impact still reverberated through the fabric of the galaxy. With each passing day, Kara marveled at the wonders they encountered, the beauty of distant worlds, the majesty of celestial phenomena, and the boundless potential of the cosmos. But amidst the awe-inspiring sights, there were also moments of quiet reflection. Alone in her quarters, Kara would often find herself pondering the nature of their existence and the mysteries of the universe. What lay beyond the stars? Were they truly alone in the vastness of space, or were there other civilizations out there waiting to be discovered? But perhaps the most profound reflection came in moments of silence, when Kara would pause to consider the significance of their journey. They had faced challenges that would have broken lesser beings, yet they had emerged stronger and more united than ever before. And though the future held countless uncertainties, Kara knew that as long as they remained true to their principles, courage, resilience and compassion, they would always find their way forward. 
As she gazed out at the stars, their light twinkling in the darkness, Kara felt a sense of peace wash over her. The journey ahead would be long and filled with trials, but she was confident that with the support of her crew and the spirit of the angry humans burning bright within them, they would continue to navigate the cosmos, leaving a legacy that would endure for generations to come. Chapter 9. The Bonds That Bind Amidst the vastness of space and the endless adventures that awaited, Captain Kara Anders found solace in the bonds that had formed among her crew. They were more than just colleagues. They were family. On the bridge of the USS Horizon, Kara watched as her crew worked together with effortless precision, each member contributing their unique skills and talents to the collective effort. They had faced dangers together, laughed together, and overcome countless obstacles together. And through it all, their bond had only grown stronger. But it wasn't just the camaraderie among the crew that filled Kara with a sense of warmth and belonging. It was also the connections they had forged with other civilizations they encountered along their journey. From the enigmatic aliens of the Andromeda system to the peaceful inhabitants of the verdant world of Serenity Prime, each encounter served to deepen their understanding of the galaxy and the diverse beings that inhabited it. And though they came from different worlds and cultures, they found common ground in their shared curiosity and thirst for knowledge. As the USS Horizon continued its voyage through the cosmos, Kara knew that it was these bonds, both among her crew and with the inhabitants of the galaxy, that would sustain them through the challenges that lay ahead. For in the vastness of space, it was the connections they formed that truly made them feel at home. And so, with each passing day, Kara and her crew ventured forth into the unknown, their hearts filled with the warmth of friendship and the knowledge that no matter where their journey took them, they would always have each other. Chapter 10. A Home Among the Stars As the USS Horizon continued its journey through the cosmos, Captain Kara Anders couldn't help but marvel at the beauty and wonder of the universe. Each new world they discovered held its own mysteries and delights, offering endless opportunities for exploration and discovery. But amidst the excitement of their adventures, Kara found herself longing for something more, a sense of belonging, a place to call home among the stars. For years, Earth had been their anchor, the cradle of humanity from which they had embarked on their journey. But as they ventured farther and farther from their home world, Kara couldn't shake the feeling that they were adrift in a vast and uncaring void. It was during one particularly quiet evening on the bridge that Kara found herself lost in thought, her gaze fixed on the stars outside. In that moment, she realized that home was not just a place, it was the people you shared it with, the bonds that held you together through thick and thin. And though they may have been thousands of light years from Earth, Kara knew that she had found her home among the crew of the USS Horizon. They were more than just colleagues, they were family bound together by a shared sense of purpose and a shared vision of a better future. As she looked around the bridge at the faces of her crew, Kara felt a sense of peace settle over her. No matter where their journey took them, they would always have each other, and that was enough to make even the vastness of space feel like home. Chapter 11. The Quest for Knowledge With each passing day, the crew of the USS Horizon delved deeper into the mysteries of the cosmos, their thirst for knowledge driving them ever forward. For Captain Kara Anders and her crew, exploration was not just a mission, it was a calling a quest to uncover the secrets of the universe and unlock its countless wonders. From the icy moons of distant gas giants to the swirling clouds of interstellar nebulae, there was no corner of the galaxy they hesitated to explore. Armed with curiosity and determination, they charted new worlds, catalogued exotic life forms, and marveled at the beauty of the cosmos. But amidst the excitement of their discoveries, there were also moments of solemn reflection. For every new world they encountered held its own challenges and dangers, and they were constantly reminded of the fragility of life in the vastness of space. Yet it was precisely this awareness of their own vulnerability that fueled their determination to press on. For with each new discovery came the opportunity to learn and grow, to expand their understanding of the universe and their place within it. And so, with the stars as their guide and the spirit of exploration burning bright within them, 
Kara and her crew continued their journey through the cosmos, their quest for knowledge driving them ever onward into the unknown. For theirs was a journey without end, a never-ending adventure fueled by the boundless curiosity of the human spirit. Chapter 12. Guardians of the Galaxy As the USS Horizon traversed the vast expanse of space, Captain Kara Anders and her crew found themselves increasingly drawn into the role of Guardians of the Galaxy. Their encounters with new civilizations and emerging threats had shown them the importance of protecting not just Earth, but all the inhabitants of the cosmos. With each passing mission, they took on new responsibilities, working tirelessly to maintain peace and stability across the galaxy. Whether it was mediating disputes between warring factions or thwarting the plans of rogue entities bent on destruction, they stood as a beacon of hope in a universe often plagued by conflict. But being guardians of the galaxy was not without its challenges, as they navigated the complexities of interstellar politics and faced ever-evolving threats, Kara and her crew were constantly tested, their resolve pushed to its limits. Yet through it all they remained steadfast in their commitment to the greater good. They knew that the fate of countless civilizations hung in the balance, and they would not rest until peace and prosperity had been secured for all. And so, with courage in their hearts, and the spirit of the angry humans burning bright within them, Kara and her crew continued their mission, knowing that as long as they stood united, they could overcome any obstacle that stood in their way. For they were not just explorers or adventurers, they were guardians of the galaxy, sworn to protect and defend all those who called the cosmos their home. And as long as they stood together, the light of hope would never be extinguished, shining bright against the darkness of the unknown.